coming back. Um, today, we're, we're going to be working on uh, a cold brew. Now, a uh, cold brew, you, you have to set up the night before. So, uh, we're here uh, this evening before tomorrow to uh, make the cold brew. So, what you're going to need is a, a cup. Uh, a scale if you have it uh, again uh, something to let the grounds soak in uh, I have this I don't know what it is uh, but I bought it on Amazon uh, now I uh, get my coffee uh, this time from a cup uh, it's paper uh, you one about maybe 30 grams something uh, for soaking and and you're gonna put that into your apparatus now the key is is you want to fill the the cup up with water first and I probably should have done that before the grounds but that's okay I'll just set the grounds off to the side and fill my cup up uh, about halfway and then I will then insert the coffee and with cold water, just slowly soak the grounds in so it becomes very saturated and slowly filling up the cup to let all the coffee grounds soak. And you'll do this well, you'll let it sit for overnight and it'll produce a little less acidity if you have tummy problems and uh, you'll also uh, have a little bit higher in, in caffeine which in the morning that'll be It'll be very nice. So we're just going to let that sit for the evening and we'll, uh, we'll come back tomorrow. Okay. So see you soon. Hi. Good morning. Uh, well, we made our cold brew La last night we started it. it it wasn't completed last night we just started it and today we're 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 going to drink it so you want to give it a little turn mix it I mean it's not cookie dough, so don't lick the spoon. <laughs> and then we'll drain it. And you can discard the coffee grounds. Or if, if you have a green thumb, Mine's white. You can use coffee grounds in uh, various soils for plants. Well, here is your cold brew that sat about eight to 10 hours, which is a uh, good time for cold brew to, to brew. And you can drink it now.
Cheers.